been promising to make a video on this here inverter I had to go down to the basement and get the box um, this is a uh, you can read that Meanwell inverter um, I bought it at PowerGateLLC.com, um, and it is a uh, it's a very 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 nice unit. Um, it has a, uh, a transfer switch in it. It has a solar 30 amp solar charge controller in it, all built in, and uh, multiple different uh, designs and functions. We go up 240 VAC. Um, this one here has the GFCI output on it. So this one is the TN 1500. Uh, you can see the quality. Uh, it's made in Taiwan. It's uh, actually a you know, next step up, better quality. Uh, these are used a lot in uh, you know boats, RVs. Um, they're very durable. They're very bug proof. Um, these guys have really designed a hell of a good inverter. And um, it is true sine wave. Um, I have learned that this is something the dealer won't tell you, but this 1500 watt man is uh, it's kind of rated low. Uh, my watt meter, this thing, this thing will hold 1800 all day long, um, not a question. And it weighs about um, 18 freaking pounds. You know, she's I don't know, 15, 16, 18 pounds. She's kind of heavy but she's solid as a rock it comes with the remote it doesn't come with cables right here um, it has RF signal choke this is the remote it has a very simple on off button um, for the remote I'm backwards here I'm upside down and um, you know it has an on and off button and on it it tells you whether or not it's in solar charge AC charge this thing also has uh, this is really a plug and leave it alone type deal <laughs> this thing here also has an AC charger of about 7 amps. So we'll say, you know, 3 o'clock in the morning, you got no wind, no solar, no nothing, of course. Um, and your batteries are getting low. Well, at, at about 12.4, 12 12.5, 12 uh, this thing will kick in on the AC. So what it has, is this is really neat, man. If it's got any solar at all, it defaults to solar. So it'll be this little one right up here lit up. And I want to show you the same controls as this, this remote with about a 10 foot cable on it, uh, 10 or 12 foot, um, is called the, um, let's see here, the IRC3. Uh, once again, Power Gate LLC. It's so amazing. They actually ship this box in box in box. <laughs> I, mean, I mean, like to protect it from, you know, falling off the earth type thing. Um, here's, here's the inverter. And it's got, right now, this is my battery. That tells me my battery. This tells me that I'm on inverter. Uh, this tells me my load. And these are in increments of about 400 uh, watts. Now, right now, I'm running coffee pot. It's just on heat function. And it, it never fails. I've actually run a refrigerator and a uh, Black & Decker coffee pot same time on this. And it's, it, it don't give a shit. Um, these, these, man, I'll tell you what. I wish I could get... Uh, let's see if I can do this. In fact, everything you see here, um, this is currently running this entire wall. Uh, the insides of this thing are, are amazing. If you could see the electronics in here, they are some seriously, seriously heavy, solid components. It does have a 30 amp fuse for its solar. And um, when I got it, um, we hooked it up to 600 watt solar uh, until I took a panel off of it. But we hooked it up and it blew the little fuse. And, and there's just, you know, these screws, two on top in the front, two in the back, and the top actually uh, clamshells off of it. And all this bottom here, and it's got its own cooling core inside. The fan is on, and it's so quiet. It's like, I don't know if it's a multi-speed, but it's so quiet you can't even hear the fan running. There's no real heat coming out of this thing. I've got it down here. Here is my uh, my hookups uh, coming through. This is from my solar panels outside, uh, lugged in, and it comes with this, you know, funny little three strands of of uh, 14 gauge that go up there but you know it equals it equals about an eight gauge wire that's the way it's built i got it on an amp gauge an amp meter uh, bar bus so i'm able to actually test it and, and see what my solar's putting out uh current time right now is about 
8 o'clock in the morning and 8 o'clock in the morning I'm getting about 7 amps into it right now um, I, it jacks all the way up to about 26 27 amps um, it doesn't doesn't have any problems there's there's the uh, power going to it there's two gauge or two aught going to feed it and I installed a separate fuse to protect the inner fuse that once it was replaced which is I'd suggest um, because you never know I mean you know and it does come with a very in-depth book um, this is an extremely in-depth book this ain't some uh, typical crap you get man this thing is, is uh, hope you're good <laughs> at comprehending technology um, I've been actually very impressed with how they do it but it, it gives you all the details all the troubleshooting it's an easily if it faults at all it easily resets um, itself and the coolest part about this thing is this black cord it runs over and it goes to and you can see it's unplugged but I normally would plug that in and at three o'clock in the morning if uh, if my batteries are low because I've had no wind no nothing I produce so much power I'm actually usually a little burnt off so but it's it's there and and it has a special NEMA 30 on it so you have to buy an adapter cord like I just have here and I've got it plugged into a standard uh, 20 or 15 amp outlet is what I'll plug it into and what it does is as soon as the Sun comes up it switches to solar so it's going to use all the solar power coming in first won't even send it to the battery it'll just use it it'll send all of that and at night it'll convert to battery and if your battery gets down to these two bars on the bottom which is 12.37 volts uh, so I tested it um, then it'll kick it into bypass and then it'll have use the AC in bypass and it'll actually send 7 amps to the battery and power the load this is a mean well. I paid about 500 and I don't know 20 uh, or 552 I think it was with shipping and handling and this thing literally oop, this thing here literally has a number of features that I am absolutely proud to own it for. Um, it comes with uh, um, just the controller or the remote the corded remote uh, the full book on it with everything in there it gives you some really good details on how to install this and you know where are you going to get one that's got a transfer switch that and it's fast it's like ups function it's super fast uh, a transfer switch a 30 amp solar charge controller handles up to about 520 watts a um a solar use factor that deliberately uses the solar straight from the panel uh is true sine wave uh has all the remotes has the parts with it um, and it's made in Taiwan which is that they have such higher standards in Taiwan than some of the other countries um, you know they made, made a good name they want to stay with it so uh, Meanwell is a company a product uh, they've been around for a while and they make some really solid high quality stuff so as you can see and then of course for my surge I've just put one of these uh, you know little starter control power station things you know you can get them for like 49 69 dollars I put that it's got an 18 amp hour battery and I put that clamped it to my lugs on both sides so when this thing here needs and demands extra fast hard power uh, that's the cheap alternative and then batteries last about four or five years and you throw them away <laughs> so and it, it doesn't it, it this thing here is never never needed it in fact I pulled the load so hard that this thing wanted to keep going and that circuit breaker blew <laughs> Um, hooking it up to a, a, a rigid shop back and had this whole wall of computers and and security cameras and all this other stuff you know I got all this crap in here fast 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 and I had it all hooked I had it all hooked up and so I was pulling about 2500 watts and it it it, it through this <laughs> and this thing here said like well I'm gonna try <laughs> so much I love that um, now it has a setting button and it goes through multiple cycles you push the button and it'll set up cycles with each one of these how to set their settings um, you can also uh, um, go online uh, through Meanwell itself and they get really really man they, they I, I'm glad to have found a company that produces an inverter that don't that you don't have to hunt for 10 years to find out who the hell they are um, but if you buy an expensive boat or an RV you're gonna find that Meanwell is the uh, is the producer 
um, of a lot of their equipment. A lot, I mean, you know, their inverters and stuff. They make a 3000 that is, uh, you know, pretty impressive. It's the same thing. I think it probably handled about 4000, probably 3500 continuous. Uh, but they underrate these. I mean, they, honest to God, underrate these. Um, they put 1500 on here, and I tell you what, it says it's got a surge of about 2500. Now, I'd probably correct that. The surge is probably about 2500, but its running is a lot higher than they claim. Um, they have a habit. I don't know if it's the, the Taiwanese that have a habit of doing this, but they underrate their stuff so that they don't have complaints. So for $552 from Powergate, uh, the guys are, uh, I wish I had the receipt to show it on video, uh, Powergate LLC, I think it is. Uh, just put in Meanwell, uh, Google or search Meanwell. I might might have a link I can find and put on my video for Powergate LLC. Uh, I recommend these guys, actually. They're out of California. Um, uh, apparently, they don't pay off Google. <laughs> Uh, so they don't get their name don't pop up when you ask for stuff but um, hopefully they're getting more popular and they've got some really cool materials and you know maybe maybe y'all get lucky you can get you one of these it's about a hundred dollars cheaper than on Amazon it's about three hundred dollars cheaper than at boats places and them guys man he went through hoops to get me the one that I wanted and you know what that's cool that's a hell of a company so anybody that literally you know, send you an email going, hey, dude, we ain't got exactly what you want, man, but look what I'm going to do. I'm going to give you this one here. It's a higher grade model. going to cost me, but I don't want a bad customer review. <laughs> you know, uh, who in the hell does that anymore? Practically nobody. Uh, them guys did. So uh, my hat's off to them for that. Um, I haven't got a chance to meet them, but I have discussed things with them once or twice. So there's your mean well, TN1500F with the... Uh, um, the standard uh, GFCI on it and uh, they do come with all kinds of even direct hookup and this over here uh, let me see if I can get this here for people who haven't uh, had much information on this this is my truly functional non-stop uh, love it to death um, rectifier now that replaced the the uh, controller that tried to burn my house down <laughs> this is Poker Do Right wish you luck on your next one goodbye